one of my favorite pieces that I've ever found at the thrift store. Hello, hello everybody and welcome back to Homestead in Bloom. I'm Kaylin and I'm so happy you're here. Today I'm going to be sharing with you a thrift haul from the recent trip we went on. We stopped in Fredericksburg before we went um, all the way to South Texas to see my husband's family. One of my absolute favorite things to do when traveling is to go look at the local thrift stores and just see what they've got. Um, it's always so much fun because you never know what you're going to find. And so, and it's nice to do it in a new place too, because I'm used to all my thrift stores, so it's nice to go to new ones and just see what they've got going on. So, in today's haul, we have a ton of clothes. We got some clothes for my daughter, who is gonna be wearing like 18 to 24 months soon, which is crazy. Every time I would go to the baby section, I would look at like, you know, the six to nine months, because that just feels like that's where she should be, but she's definitely not. She's growing like crazy. So we got some nice spring and summer pieces for her wardrobe. And then I got a couple things. We also got a couple home decor things. And then we found some things for my husband at a flea market in South Texas. So I'm excited to share all of these things with you. Stay tuned till the end for my most favorite thrift find that I think I've ever found. So let's go ahead and jump right in. Okay, so this very first piece of clothing is so adorable. I loved the little vegetables on it. It's got like um, turnips, I think, and carrots. And I thought it was just so cute. And it's in an 18 month, and we got this at um, Goodwill. And it was $1.99, so I thought that was perfect price. It's also super soft, so I'm excited for her to wear this. And then the next place we stopped was Texas Thrift, and I found these super adorable little shorts in an 18 month as well, and they were $4.99, and I didn't realize, but they match perfectly. So she's got a whole little outfit ready to go for spring and summer. And then at Texas Thrift, I really hit the jackpot when it came to girls' clothes. I also found this little dress and it's just so cute. Look at the little details on the front. I love this um, burnt orange color. It's kind of coming up more vibrant on camera, but in person it's like a deeper um, burnt orange. And so I love that. This one was $7.99, so a little bit more expensive but it's still cheaper than if I was buying it new and I know that she'll wear this a ton in the spring and summer. This one we got is so precious. And this one is by Little Planet, I believe, by Gerber, or no, Carter's. And it's organic. And this one was $4.99, but it's a green tag and they were doing half off green tags. So that was an incredible deal. And I love how it's got the long legs on it so this will be perfect for the spring whenever it's still a little bit cooler um, but then it's still made out of like a gauze material so even in the summertime she'll still be able to wear it without getting too too hot this is so precious i found these little this little overall dress and if you look closely it's got little butterflies and flowers on it and i just thought it was precious and this one was $7.99 and it's a 2T, so, but it's overall, so I feel like even if it's a little bit big, it will be fine. But ah, I can just imagine her like running around outside, playing in the garden with her little piggy tails. It's going to be so cute. Okay, this one is a 12 to 18 month, and this is from Old Navy. It's got some beautiful embroidery on the sleeves, which I thought was so pretty and it was $4.99. So it's kind of odd because some of their prices seemed kind of high to me, but then you have pieces like this where it's only $4.99 and it seems like, you know, they charged $7.99 for this. I don't, I don't, I don't get the pricing, <laughs> but anyways, this one's super cute. This will be more of a spring piece because in Texas, even though it is a gauze material, I think this one will get a little bit hot. So we're gonna use that one in the spring. And then I found a pair of just plain bloomers. 
Um, since they're a denim, it will just go with everything. So I figured this was a good staple and they were just $2.99. And I got this little dress. Whenever I was shopping, I asked her, um, I grabbed a bunch of stuff and like held it up and asked her if she liked it. And she goes, yes, yes. So she loves the flowers on this one. And once again, I think with her red hair, this will just be so beautiful on her. And then the last thing we got, for her at least, is this little denim outfit. And this one was $4.99. Oh, I don't know if I said the last, oh. So this one was $5.99, this little flower dress, but it was a green tag, so it was 50% off. So that was super exciting. And then yes, this one was $4.99, and I feel like this will be good since it's an 18 month. I think we can put like a long sleeve with it if it gets colder, like towards the winter time, and some tights, but then in the summer she can just wear it like this. So yeah, we found so many cute things. Now for some things that I got for myself, I had my favorite cardigan and I washed it with, I don't even know what it was, but something black and it turned it gray and I don't wear gray. I don't really wear gray or black. My leggings are black, but that's pretty much it. And so I was heartbroken because I wore this sweater all the time. And so I found another one. This is from Old Navy and it was $5.99, but it's a green tag. So it was half off. And yes, oh wait, I said Old Navy, it's universal thread. But yeah, the material is kind of like this waffle, almost like a waffle knitted cardigan, but not waffle knit, if that makes sense. So yes, I love the material of it. I love the color and it like for dresses like this, I can just throw this over it and it um, adds a layer of warmth and it also is super cute. So I'm so excited to find that and that it was half off. This next one, I'm not quite sure if I should have got it, honestly. It is a wish list apparel dress, and I love the pattern on it. It's just these beautiful little dainty flowers on a burnt orange dress, but it's short, and I tried it on with the bump and it's still long enough, it still goes to my knees. So I'm hoping that in the spring, um, postpartum, you know, whenever the belly is not quite so big, <laughs> that it will be a little bit longer. I'm so used to wearing like maxi length and midi length dresses that anything knee length just feels very short, even though it's like an average length or a normal length for people. But I really loved the color, I loved the pattern, and so I figured I'm just gonna go ahead and try it. And then the sleeves are also very beautiful. They're kind of like a balloon sleeve. But this one was $12.99, so definitely on the pricey side. I really did contemplate whether I wanted it for a while, while I was shopping around, but in the end I thought, you know what, it'll be a beautiful church dress, or, you know, just like a fancier, fancy your dress to have in your closet. And one of the things that sold me on it is the fact that it is um, function, it does have functioning buttons. So for nursing, it'll be easy access. So I went ahead and got it. We'll see how much I get to wear it. Okay, now jumping into one of my favorite pieces that I've ever found at the thrift store. When I say I, that my jaw dropped to the floor when I saw this, I am not kidding at all. I have been on the hunt for a quilt for years. I don't have any like family quilts. I don't have any quilts. And so I've always wanted one. I see so many beautiful quilts like on Instagram and my friends, they have like those blanket ladders with beautiful quilts on them. And I've definitely been envious of it because they're just so, so pretty. And so I was looking through the blankets and I found this one and I just almost squealed with excitement. It was only $3.99 at Goodwill. No, $3.59 at Goodwill. And I came home and opened it up and it's really not in that horrible of a condition. It definitely has like spots where um, the sewing or the threads have like, you know, come apart right here. And there's also a couple stains, but honestly, 
I don't even mind. It's beautiful. See, there's a couple stains right there. But it just adds character to it. I don't even mind at all. So yes, it is a small quilt. So I would say it's probably like a twin. But I'll show you real quick. Isn't that just so beautiful? So yes, super, super excited about that one. And yeah, I've seen where some people will um, turn old quilts into like a quilted jacket. And I thought about doing that with this one, but I just love the fact that I finally have a quilt. So I probably won't, um, but it is an option that would be fun to do. The next thing that I got is this beautiful plate. I have the um, dishes that are similar to this in the pink. So I've got just the dinner plates. I don't have like the whole setup, but I love the colors of this one. Honestly, the pink that I have is not quite like my house is more earth tones. I tend to wear more earth tones. And so this was just like oh, so, so pretty. The Goodwill that we went to in South Texas had all of their like dishes and stuff on top of the racks with the clothes. And so my normal thrift store has like a section for all of the home goods. And so I was just walking down the aisle going to check out and I saw this and thank goodness I did because it's so pretty, but it was only 99 cents. And so I had to get it because I do quite a bit of hosting. And I think that this would just be a perfect addition to put, you know, really anything on this plate. I think this would be perfect to put on the countertop as we're creating our little spread and so yes i was just so excited to find this and hopefully one day i can find more of these dishes because i just think that the colors are so so pretty lastly we went to a flea market while we were in south texas and i did not find anything however my husband hit the jackpot when it came to work shirts so i'm gonna go ahead and show you what we got this first one is a Wrangler shirt and he loves these shirts to work in because the material on them is pretty thick and so they're very durable. And yeah, this one, I believe it was $10, which this was the most expensive shirt that we got. Um, and it even has like a little stain on the back, but like I said, it's a work shirt and so it's gonna get more stains it's totally fine and it's still cheaper than if you were buying it brand new so yeah i love the color of this one i love the simplicity of it and he liked it too the next shirt we got this is one that i picked out <laughs> and you can tell because the colors are a little bit more muted and like earth tones but i loved the colors of this shirt he's got red hair and blue eyes and so this blue is gonna look beautiful on him and I thought that this would be a good shirt that could be a church shirt as well. Um, I know a lot of the time it's easy to find work shirts, but church shirts are a little bit more tricky. And so I thought this would be perfect for that. So that's what we'll probably do with that one. And then these next shirts are all work shirts. So my husband has always loved like the vintagey like wranglers and just like the retro shirts i know when we were dating he was really into like the aztec prints like vintage shirts and so that was always fun i would find a ton of them at the thrift store which is weird because i don't find any of them anymore so um anyways this one is more toned down but it's still a little wild <laughs> it's got like the three um color blocks with the you know the crazy stripes the blue, and then the maroon color. And so I thought this one was really pretty as well. And so he'll get a lot of use out of this one as a work shirt. Oh, and this one was $3. This last one was $3 as well. The rest of the men's shirts are three bucks. The only expensive one was that nice Wrangler at the beginning. And then he was so excited when he saw these because the Wrangler 20X shirts are his favorite shirts to work in. And so he got this one in yellow and it's just a yellow plaid. You can see the 20X um, emblem right here. And yeah, $3 for a work shirt is not a bad deal at all, especially whenever he knows that he's gonna get a ton of use out of it throughout the year. And then the very last one is also a 20X 
and the color is more of a red and yellow and white and blue obviously the majority of the shirt is blue but um yeah just another 20x shirt like i said he loves the way that these fit his body he's six four so he's a big old guy <laughs> so it's always good whenever he finds a brand that he likes and then it's especially good whenever we can find it at the thrift store for a better price but yeah that's everything we found while we were on our trip and i hope you enjoyed this video i always love getting to watch these because obviously you can't just go and go to the same store and buy the same thing but it's always just fun to see what treasures people find because thrifting is truly like a treasure hunt and this year i've made it a point to be more intentional with the things that we're buying um, like for my daughter, I bought all the things that she's going to grow into and I tried to find functional pieces that she would really use. And then for me, I got the sweater and that's very functional for me. My husband's got work shirts. So I'm trying to reel it in because even though thrifting is so much fun, it still can get expensive if you're buying stuff that you don't need. So <laughs> I'm trying to be very intentional about that this year and yeah that's pretty much it thank you so much for watching i really appreciate you being here and if you really enjoy these videos i would love it if you would give a thumbs up and you can comment down below what your favorite thrift find of mine was i would love to hear what you thought and i'll see you in the next video bye guys